Hello, it's Black Ivini here. Lick Lock and Dini Ministries here. And yep, we celebrating that. So I was shopping and I would just put everything out so you guys could see all the things we would be making in the videos to come. And we are excited. Hubby just left. We are excited because this is my dream as a chef. And we gonna do this thing with Jesus on the pinnacle. Yes, we will. So now we will go through the groceries. I got them from Tropical Market. I don't know if you guys are familiar with Tropical or Bostonians, but yes, that is where I went to accomplish. I went to Whole Foods to get the turkey and the ham, which is here in the fridge being loved on by the temperature see them we gonna make them <laughs> so let me put y'all on my stove so i could get to tell y'all what we gonna do today well on thanksgiving so we have mac and cheese we have haitian mac and cheese american mac and cheese i wanted to try it this year but my husband like you can't just do all of this without no Haitian mac and cheese though. Just for him. I'll do my Haitian mac and cheese for him. Um, these are the cheeses that I will be putting in the American mac and cheese. Sharp cheddar, provolone, and mozzarella. Of course Velveeta. Um, this is the brand I use for Haitian mac and cheese. Why are you laughing? This is the brand I use for Haitian mac and cheese. Let's come put it in the light. There we go. Um, we have a few boxes of that. I put it your noodles away. Um, we of course have black pepper. Black pepper. We're moving on towards the next bag. We have mushrooms, white mushrooms. Put you guys in the light. And then we're going to slice that baby up. And you know what we're going to make? Mushroom gravy. Let's try that, right? Mushroom gravy to put on top of the mashed potatoes that we're about to make. The red skin mashed potatoes. We have our Brussels sprouts. And I'm excited because they had the huge Brussels sprouts, so they don't have to burn easy when I try to make them, right? And that's going to be along the turkey, alongside of the turkey. You got to put your stuff away. Sorry. But yes, we use Maggi here. We don't really use salt. We use Maggi. And yeah, Maggi just does the trick for us. We have these beautiful bell peppers, green. That is what I'm going to do the it piece with. Yes, I will have a video of how Like Eileen Ministries does her it piece. And we will be amazing. This is smoked paprika. I have finally got my smoked paprika. And smoked paprika was introduced to me in school by, by Chef Barton. Not Barton. Chef Harris. And smoked paprika. We're gonna put it in something. Parsley flakes. Parsley flakes. You can't go wrong with badilla seasoning. We have garlic. And I will make a video of how I puree my garlic in order to preserve it for as much as I want for within a month. So we will show you that video when that time comes. We have limes, and they're juicy. We have limes that I finally found juicy limes. They will always be dry, and but this is juicy. So, we have our limes, which we will use to wash the chicken, and I will show you guys how Like I Lily Ministries do that. Smoked neck bones, huh? What you want? You want the animals? Alright. If you need assistance. 
give me a second, you know? Mommy just came with groceries. Go ahead, go sit with that so you don't drop it on yourself. So, um, we will be using pork neck bones for the collard greens that we will be making. We'll be making collard greens and smoked neck bones, and we will have a video for that! <laughs> um, okay, put this is the way. And these pineapple chunks I will be using for the ham that I will be demonstrating as well. You want a scroll? All right. Yes. yes, I will give you a scroll. Here you go. Go with that. The other box for the Haitian mac and cheese. I think I'll be using like one and a half, depending on how it looks when I'm making it. This is the olive oil that I use, and this will be in a video with the um, garlic puree that I make in order to make food faster. I know Haitians love to peel this stuff. Me, I don't. I don't got time for that. Vap, 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 infini. You feel me? So we got honey because we will be putting honey in the ham that we're about to make for Thanksgiving. Carnation milk, carnation for that Haitian mac and cheese. Yes, go sit with that please. For the Haitian mac and cheese, we have the evaporated carnation milk. More garlic because garlic just makes your life better. My grandma would always say, oh, by if I can lie, like bro. <laughs> And this is lime juice that I use on my meals, not for customers. I use natural lime for customers. We have yep, we use a lot of these in in piece. When we make white rice, we start off with this, then Add that water, some salt, boom, white rice. Haitian style. We have collard greens that we will be making. I will show you guys how, you know, my mom taught me to do it. And we go make it do what it do. Yeah, that's what it has. So, yes. We have parsley, parsley for the Ippies video we will make. I bought, I wanted a, a wooden spatula, but I guess this is what they have. So, I mean, it, it will do the work, you know, whenever we get there. We have onions, beautiful onions. I use this coconut for um, my rice is my my dill I sometimes put it in my sauce well. but yes this is the one we use here at La Calini we put this in the freezer that's where it goes and we will be putting celery in our ippies yes I am trying to put celery in our ippies so it could be you know Give it that health, that wealth benefit that we need. You know? No, you could just stay here for right now. We have rosemary and chives. Rosemary, I think we will be putting this in the mashed potato meal. When we make the mashed potatoes. And then um, also the turkey. I would like to put some rosemary in that turkey as well. I'm not gonna put it in my whole ippies, but I will put it in um, the ippies for the and ippies. Y'all keep hearing me say ippies. Ippies is seasoning, Cajun seasoning with his bell peppers, scallions, red and green peppers, or whatever bell pepper you want, onions, oil, anything you want. But you always gotta make it that that goo. With, with Maggi and you know all the seasonings that you put in your ippy. We have the four cheese blend. We will sprinkle on top. 
We have the four cheese blend we will sprinkle on top. My guy, can you get down? Can you get down? Please, go get Mr. Froggy. Then you could be high. Go get Mr. Froggy. Apologies, but yes, we have the four cheese blend that we will sprinkle on top of the mac and cheeses in order to make it cheesy. Yes, and today's Taco Tuesday, so I might be doing a video about how we do the tacos and stuff with my husband. And maybe, of course, if you know, he's having bad hair day, we will be doing his hair soon. So, um, yeah, what's next? We have mammals, more Velveeta. No, we, uh, we have cream cheese. This is the first time that I will be cheese. doing um Check. cream Lattice. cheese and macaroni. Check. My sister, Charlene Oscar, and not Oscar, Charlene G. That's my sister. She recommended me do it, and I was hesitant at first, but then Check. I seen tutorials of people using it, and I was like, Roll. okay, let's just try it Check. to see. And it does make it and more creamy, I guess. So we will be using cream cheese. Watermelon. Um, we have our beautiful red bell peppers. Red bell peppers. They're spicy. No, they're not. They're sweet. We have the uh, the. Mom, I don't like to eat those. South peppers. mac and cheese. They are. I wouldn't call it the American mac and cheese. I would call they it the are South spicy. mac and cheese. Spicy. Can I eat one? We have stuffing Mom. for the turkey. This is the type of stuffing mom, I use. I Some people get fancy with it. I just wine, like this mom, one. Like, can it really eat just one. tickles my pickle. Mom, can I eat one? Not right now. I can't eat one. When I slice it later. Slice it like this a banana? Not like a banana, but we will slice it so you can taste it. This is the cornbread that I use. And there will be a tutorial for that. Check. All check, check, check. More carnation. More carnation. Mm -hmm. And first these are the got. carrots that I love from Tropical because they're ate just like when I blanch them. Carrots. They're just oh so amazing. So mom, amazing. rabbits eat carrots, mom. Yes, they do. And mom. this. Is the red skin potatoes Mom, that I will be using in order for me Mom, to do the mashed potatoes? Rabbit, I kind of surprised my husband with this one. He thought I was going to do regular, but carrot, I'm doing red skins. Rabbit, and I'm using the skins carrot. in them. And we Just like they taught me in school. This one, 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 this And that is it. I will show you my groceries and my little boy. Just and Theo is just too much. He talk about something. He want to go to vacation at Grandma's house. I'm like, Theo, you spoiled. Cause I didn't ask for a vacation when I was your age. How how do you even know a vacation? Like I need a vacation. <laughs> But, um, yes, um, I'm just rearranging everything so you guys can see everything that I will be using in this Thanksgiving thing that I want to do where I post all of my, um, the dishes that I do. And I will show you guys how to do my earpiece. I will show you guys my ham the way I do my ham I will show you guys my first my first attempt of doing um, southern mac and cheese um, I would be doing Haitian mac and cheese I would be doing turkey my turkey yes gobble, gobble. I'll show you guys how I tender it up and make it all nice and Make all the juices flow evenly inside as it glow, grow, and go in that oven. Yes. And mind you guys, I got my oven ready 
we're Thanksgiving. Look how beautiful my baby look. No spots. Ow, 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 ow. That's pretty cool. <laughs> but yes, I will name all the ingredients that I will be using ah! and partaking in this Thanksgiving menu. I think I got a little bit more minutes left to finish the video. Izio and Dad playing. You know, y'all hear him. I guess he left me to go to Dan. All right. Organize this a little so you guys can see. What your girl about to do? What we about to do? As you guys already seen, the turkey and the ham, the and the ham. is being tempered in the fridge. This is the ground beef I will also be using for the Haitian mac and cheese because the Haitian mac and cheese requires ground beef. So we will be doing that. All right, sorry. All right, so now, are you guys ready to go through these ingredients again? I got time. <laughs> what? Yeah, go ahead, go with dad. So, and these are the new spoons. I soaked them that we got or whatever. Um, Again, we will go through this. This is red skin potatoes, our green onions, or scallions as you could call them, our onions that we will be using. This is our smoked pork neck. This is the carrots that we'll be using to dress up the turkey. This is the collard greens underneath. This is a red bell peppers. This is white mushrooms and we will slide that up and do what a mushroom gravy yes so um these are the pineapple chunks pineapple chunks that um, we will be using on the ham this is the maggi that we use this is maggi and mozzarella for the southern mac and cheese mozzarella provolone, sharp cheddar, and Philadelphia cream cheese, rosemary, chives, this is parsley, this is limes, this is Brussels sprouts, see how huge it is, see how huge it is? This is the celery that I will be using. The celery parsley flakes. This is the garlic, peeled garlic. This is the honey we use. This I use for my personal use. This is the evaporated milk. These, this is for the Haitian mac. This is for Southern Mac. And mushroom. And top. Cornbread. Mom, let's see this, Mom. This is the oil we use again. What do we call it? Green bell, call this? green bell peppers. These are the green bell peppers. This is garlic. And there you have it. My groceries ready. for Thanksgiving. And I'm ready. Are you guys ready to see these videos? Because we ready. We ready. We ready to cook it up. And my husband will be my assistant with the cameras. Uh, we will get better, but we are beginning now. <laughs> you want again? You want another one?
Yo. I'll get this. You had enough, bro. You had enough.